Orange Rush, I've been looking for you. Your family sent you money again this month. Here's 1,000 dual points. Don't waste your dual points. Use them wisely. That's pretty, uh... Awful. That's like two battles worth. Power Destructions, yeah. This one will be good. So let's just spend 10,000. go everything is just gonna have like 1800 attack that's what it looks like like just your normal starter summons uh, hopefully a couple of them are machines yeah this is gonna really make our deck more advanced. They're all kinda... They're kinda boring. Oh, we got Slate Warrior. Slate Warrior is so good. We got Jedi Gumo, which is sorta good. It starts, it's like, uh... Jedi Gumo is similar to Goblin Attack Force, where it has a lot of uh, attack for one summon, but it's got some thing. Okay, if you attack another 2,400 attack monster, it doesn't get destroyed. But if it does get destroyed, you get to return one monster on the field to its owner's hand, so... That... that kind of sucks, but... Slate Warrior is great. Slate Warrior is such a good card. I put it in every deck I had when I was a kid. Uh, increase the attack and defense of this monster by 500 points if you flip it. Now, if you have Swords of Revealing Light, awesome. But if you... If it gets destroyed, you get to decrease the attack of that monster by 500 what exactly does Jedi Gumo do? When you attack, toss a coin. If you call it right, you attack normally. If you get it wrong, you still get to attack, but you have to reduce your life points in half. I'm gonna use this, actually. Like, I am... I have enough chance to win, I don't really need to care. This guy I didn't know existed. I didn't know there was another 1900 attack guy, but he's an Archfiend Soldier. Gigantus is an Earth. No, you gotta remove a card from your graveyard. Yeah, these... These are all going in. I like how Hysteric Fairy looks. Uh, cause... They have glasses. And this guy you sacrifice for. Remove a couple cards from play, if you want. Cave Dragon. What does Cave Dragon do? Okay, it's pretty much Cyber Dragon, but you need a Dragon-type monster on your field for it to attack. No, that's misleading. It's not like Cyber Dragon. There's no face-up Kozuki on the floor. Destroy this card, so this card is terrible this because he has like 500 attack but if it is destroyed no you lose life points <laughs> this is the terrible card terrible terrible card no we're good thanks 
Like, it's weird. When I'm dueling, I start to hear these strange voices. I wonder what they are. I'd be delicious if the monsters were talking to me. Bro, that guy has no friends or self-esteem. It's almost New Year's Day. I gotta make a New Year's revolu resolution. I promise to give up grilled cheese sandwiches. Nah, forget it. That's your whole personality, dude. You have to get a personality before you can give up parts of it. Yeah, everything with less than 1900 attack and no awesome ability, you're going away. Like, I might not even keep Maneater Bug. I like having Spear Dragon as an option. Maybe only one of those guys. I added the three Jedi Gumos. There we go. Oh, well maybe I missed a character. I am good tidings. I am the headmaster of Raw Yellow. Sartir, don't let my aura of vigor intimidate you. Ah, uh, you must be the one clamoring to learn about dual theory. Now, now, no need to be embarrassed. I have plenty of lesson plans planned. No, you cannot win on theory alone. You must physically compete. Very well, I will face you. And second, because I got my guy. I don't know, maybe the goblin attack force is better. But I'm as ex totally expecting this guy to be awesome. Painted Wisdom. He is bringing his Tainted Wisdom back from the dead. And another Tainted Wisdom. You see, I have brains. Oh, that would have been awful if I... No, I'm not gonna... Maybe I don't like Jedi Gumo that much. Like, you have to really, really disrespect your opponent in order to use that. can't trap whole a Jinzo though. So when he puts another trap down, he won't be able to destroy it. So I will just save it until he has a face down trap card. cards does he use? He, what's the A-Team? Trap Disposal Unit. When this card is changed from attack position to defense position, shuffle your own deck. Why would that possibly be useful? And then he uses the this guy, that guy, and some guy cards. Apparently totally unreliable. He, has won he wonders if he has incredible potential. 
a zero attack, zero defense. But these guys, if you get all three of them or something, they have a really awesome... Uh, ...effect together, but they're, they're not nice. Well done. Perfect tactics and strategies. I feel like making you my assistant. Why are you making that face? Oh yeah, so now that we're in raw yellow, we can battle Chaz Princeton. Come on, Orange Rash. What are you scared of? Getting humiliated? I... Uh, so... What does he use? He uses XYZ Dragon Cannon. I use a ton of trash. My spell card, Mystic Plasma Zone, will send you running home to mommy. I don't remember what that does. Okay, this guy is a bully, dude. You're summoning Hain Hain in attack position, dude? Eat this, slacker. Dark monsters by 500. There, this. Yeah, I'm gonna destroy my own monster so that I can destroy his snatch steel. I don't want it going back into his hand with my true nade. He actually has a tribute summon guy. Now, you think it's strong, but it's not. It's just because of his field spell. On this card, he has piercing damage. And you get a discard every time you attack directly. So if I summon this, and then use this, I can just whop you. Not my Methist, the Infernal General! He should have waited to put that guy there, because... Now its defense is decreased because of the field spell. And he likes Decayed Commander. Oh yeah, I only have a 50% chance to lose half my life points. Oh. What's Robin Zombie do? Uh, each time you do damage, one card... Okay, so he's got like a... You discard from your deck, or you mill from your deck, you discard from your hand. And then everything is general themed. I lost. Me lose. 
I'll get you next time, Orange Rash. You better believe it. So I think that means we can battle Alexis also, yeah. Hey you, wanna duel? There's something interesting about your style. Thanks. You better not take me lightly because I'm a girl. Let's see how good you are. It's my turn. I draw. Well, I have all three of my true names, so I'm gonna... And two, two attack forces. So I may as well use it now. And that's just to intimidate. Oh really, I got my third goblin attack force. I figured. Yep. Seriously, are you trying at all? I reveal my face down card. Call of the Haunted. Melbeck. Oh, Kelbeck. What does Kelbeck do? I've never seen this card before in my life. Any monster that attacks this card is returned to its owner's hand. Damage calculation is applied normally. Oh, that's pretty good. Like, that's like an actually usable version of Hain Hain. Well, I mean, you don't get to choose, but it has to match a certain criteria anyway. Oh, but if I gain control of it... And then something else attacks it. No, no, I, I'm on to nothing. I got it backwards. Okay, she has she has some life gaining effects. A lot of life gaining. I don't know what Sanctuary in the Sky does, but I don't want to find out. Maybe she's a success because she her got her money from the gym teacher just like me. Battle damage to the controller of a fairy type battle monster from a battle becomes zero. She made me discard my card destruction. So if I had used it myself... I would have drawn one fewer card. Oh, really? I only have the goblin attack forces. Do wanna I'll just draw the one card. Haha. -ha. What else am I gonna do with this guy? Manju of the ten thousand hands. Yeah, but her, uh... 
Monsters don't seem to have very high attack in general. She looks like girl Joey. Oh, we're, we're gonna lose for sure. I'll just I'll just click surrender. Cheer up! All of us lose sometime. Yeah, so that's those guys. <laughs>